Hello, you're good to see you. Welcome back to Non-League and Beyond on Wayne FC. It's episode 66, and can we get to our first final? Our first major final. We just got to beat May United in the semi-final of the Carver Cup. So can we get to our first final? Can we beat May United in the semi-final of the Carver Cup? I've got everything crossed. I really, really want to get to our first major, major final. The Carver Cup, I'm calling it. We've never come anywhere close of getting anywhere like that. Okay, last episode, we beat Newcastle in the fourth round of the Carver Cup. Lost to them in the league. We had a little dodgy foul it. Drew, a point against Tottenham, great. Played a friendly for dynamics like I always do when there's a bit of a gap. Just to boost everyone up, get back to winning ways. But we drew against Hearts. Lost against Man City, 3-0, but it's Man City. Making excuses. But this spell here is a really good spell. Beat Everton 2-1. Fuentes with a couple of goals. Crystal Palace, three all here. We should have won this game. And then he got sent off in the 80th minute and they scored a penalty on the 93rd minute. A 1-0 win against Millwall. A 1-0 win against Bournemouth. We're just getting the wins. Anila, uh, a 3-0 win. And we played really, really well. 3-0 win against Arsenal. Petit Jean, DiMaggio, Anila. Uh, and then a 1-0 draw in the league against Arsenal, which is great as well. Anila, uh, Leeds. Another great performance, 5-1. Uh, to pairs, Thomas, Anila, Brown on the score sheet there. West Ham, we beat 4-2. Anila, DiMaggio, Thomas scoring a couple of goals. Uh, and then we played Man United in the league. And was it close? Not really. They had more possession, more shots. But I just want to show Tobias Tarrant for Man United. I think this must be the best central defender I think I've ever seen in my life. Strength 18, stamina, so pace, uh, acceleration, work rate could be a little bit better, technique, tackling 18, uh, passing 11, marking 15, determination 18, leadership 16, he just concentration 16, anticipation 17, he looks amazing, he looks absolutely amazing, but not just that, he's 6 foot 6, a jumper reach of 19, and heading of 18, he's only got 3 goals, this guy here, if you've got the corner routine on it, this guy here would score a lot, a lot of goals. And that's most probably the best central defender I've ever seen on FM. He absolutely, looks absolutely amazing. Right, enough talking about their team. It's all about our team. All right, we've got Man United over two legs. And I've got Grinsby, the game in between. We will play both legs of this Man United game. Let's get to it. League-wise, let me quick look. I feel like I'm rushing it. Don't rush it, Tony. Slow down. We're in 12th in the league. 30 points. We're nice and comfortable now. Everything's looking good. We're playing the Weymouth 8. We're going to go Rudd. Petitjohn's going to be playing left back. That's going to be a big problem. Plasky, Asselin, Brunt's just going to play right back. DiMaggio, Lang, Denise, Dominguez on the right. Thomas and Anila up front. Sudoku is injured, which is a big miss. Newell was suspended to play left back, which is an even bigger miss. Fuentes is missing to play on the right, which is even bigger, bigger miss because he's absolutely amazing. And uh, De La Rosa's injured as well, which is not much of a miss at all. Let's get to it. And Mephi also injured our wonder kid. I'm going to call him our wonder kid. He was a wonder kid for me. Uh, amazing. Just still hasn't really done it in the league though. 6.64. I'm hoping now the tactic didn't suit them. But this way of eight, the tactic does suit them. That's what that's what I'm hoping. Let's get to it. Enough talking. A few more clicks away. I haven't actually played the save for a little while. It's been about a week. I haven't played it. So come back to it. Hopefully... We can crack on for that main night of the game where we lost against them 2 1. We can crack on what we we're doing beforehand. Pressure with the underdogs. Let's also give some faith out as well because uh, let's uh, want to motivate them a little bit. Don't want them to feel too much pressure or that they can't do it. They can do it. They can do it. Come on. I hope we can do it. It's the home leg. We can um, get a 1 0 win here, 2 0 win. A draw maybe and then go to their place and try and sneak a win get it out lang it's still there the bellingham they got a great team thomas mohawk man pass is not the best uh yeah we can somehow we we actually gonna need to win this i can't see us beating may night at their place so we're gonna need a win here they're for sure we're gonna need a win here for sure uh one or two two goals would be great just a 1-0 and then just hope for the best. Hopefully we can get a draw at their place. Morty, it's three minutes in and we've not really had a, a chance. Uh, even not even a little glimmer of a chance. We've just been 
defending for our lives. And luckily, that's straight to the keeper. Three minutes in. I think we should need to just calm it down a little bit. Just slow it down a bit. That's it, Rod. Take your, take, take your time. Hoof's up there. We've got a Nyla up there. He's six foot six. He can't get to the ball. Ball through. Wow. Should be one nil down. We should be one nil down. Luckily for us, Leonardo, was it? Couldn't score. They've got a great, great team. A really good team. And there's that Tarrant at centre back. Like I say, he's mostly the best at centre back I've ever seen. He's really, really good. Better than Van Dyke. Right, come on. Come on, lads. Let's have a chance. Let's have a chance. Uh, like I said, this wave of eight been doing all right. We've turned a corner. We've started winning games. I feel like we're starting to get into this a little bit. We've had a couple of shots. Hopefully, this will be the one that we actually see actual good chance for us. We hoof up there. And Nile is through. It's a good kick. It's an amazing kick. Oh, I was ready to celebrate. I was ready to celebrate. Denise, far post. Nyla, Brunst. Thomas. Pasky, Tijon. Keeper saves. Good. We've had a couple of chances. We've had a couple of chances. I think we can score. I hope we can score. We need to score. We're going to need to score. Dominguez with a really poor head that just uh, goes straight to a main United player. Five minutes to go. Dominguez going to do a good, a bit, a bit, some good defensive work. To Maggio out to, oh my goodness me. Back to him. Denise again. On the left hand side. Good pass. Free kick to Man United. Thought it was another chance. At least. No, we are actually creating stuff now. So it's a positive. Positive. Just before we go into the half time, it is half time. There was a positive. So second half. Go out there like we finished the first half. You've done well. Keep going. I don't like what I saw. A very good first half. I'm going to say very good. I thought it was a good performance. Early on, I can't can't deny, three, four minutes in, it looked like it was going to be a bit of a 5 niller. Uh, but so far, nil nil, not bad. Defensively, pretty DiMaggio's gone. It's not, a, it's not an episode without someone getting sent off. It's not. It makes it so much harder. It makes it so much harder. Lang's gonna co come off. The fan I can go there. Absolute Wally. Just when you need to keep calm. Keep Anila's on a yellow as well. Good Petijon. Actually doing all right for a change. He's really um, a player that I've always had high hopes for. I've just been waiting for him to turn up. He just hasn't. We've got a chance here, Denise. Two, we've had two in this game. We've had two really good chances where we have actually should have scored. I know <laughs> May and I would have also had some good chances where they should have scored, but Mendes, I've never really given him a chance. How tall are these guys? 5'11", because I've got Anila 5'8". I've got Anila to go near post or far post, to try and win the headers, six foot six, so, I'm going to put Tamos on the left, he's five, uh, was it, five eleven, courage, Rudd, long ball forward, Mate, now, I'm thinking, let's just, a draw here, go to their place, and cause an upset, that's what I'm thinking, upset, that's what we need, upset on the cards, good, and clearance, Mendes can control it can get to it may not again for fana he's on a yellow card already he's ain't been on too long denise out to the left thomas mohawk man unlucky oh I just feel like we just need to get the ball get the ball leonardo again with a great chance may not his best chance earlier on and may not his best chance again and he still can't score which is great let's keep it that way let's keep it that way uh, offside ref. Offside ref. Offside ref. Thank you. I don't need to look at it. Do we need to look at it? It's close. Very, very. This second half, we've not been in it. But what do you expect when we got a man less and we're just trying to hold on? Trying to hold on. Rashford. Ball into the box. Clearance. Thomas. Wrong way. Dominguez. Hold it for a little bit. Good to Mendes. Back to Asselin. 
Is anyone making a run? Pass it, please pass it. Yes, Brunst getting forward. Dominguez in the box. And I thought that was a chance for Fana. I feel there's going to be a chance here. This could be it. This could be it. Come on, Tijon. He's had a great game. game he's had a great game at left back for a change. Telling me he's on a 6.3, but I feel like he's played well out there. Maybe they're saying it's a 6.3 because his actual finishing. He's had two good chances and they've been absolutely terrible. Pasqui, don't be stupid. Dominguez. Mendez is offside, well offside. He's well offside. He's well offside. He's a mile offside. Not even close. Not even close. We will check it out. Look out. Look at the gap. <laughs> it's not even not even close he's on a six i don't think he's done that bad is he uh i don't think patijon's done well as i said his finishing has been pretty poor brown i was going to bring brown on but he's nervous but janovic's composed just need a bit of freshness in defense uh, let's bring St stewart's not proper fit and Petition's played well defensively, but I'm still going to take him off. Thomas, there's no one to play out front. So, Thomas, you're on a six, so you're going to have to keep on going. Look, we've got minutes to go with, with 10 men. Can we hold on for the draw? Five bloody minutes of injury time. Five minutes. That's four minutes too long for my liking. Good, Brunst. Out to the right. I can see what he's trying to do. He's trying to waste time, trying to kill the game off, but it's not over yet. There's still... Dominguez? Thomas. He's on a six. And that's the sort of thing, person that's our plan as a six is doing. Nothing. They get a bit of luck. Comes back to him. Pasky with a good clearance. Thomas. Can't take him off. There's no one to play up front. Oh, you're joking me. You're joking me. Good goal. Let's... No, don't. 1-0. 1-0, we can still do it. <laughs> It'd be hard, but we can still do it. Is anyone going to close that down? What I don't want to happen now is concede another quick goal. Another quick goal will be terrible. Go on, get in there. Go on, tackle him. Come on. Good run. Great, great save. And we are holding on again. Let's get out. Let's get to the second game. Let's get to the second leg. Let's get to the second leg. We. And then just hope we can do something at Old Trafford. Maybe some players might come back from injury. Rudd, good save. Hold it there. Then just a massive boot up there. Right. It's not too... We had some chances. That's the thing. We had some chances. So, so did they did have a few more chances than us. But um, I see in training we weren't good enough. He did yourself proud. I think he played all right. It's okay. Not too bad. Right. Let's get to the second leg where we've got it all to do. So before we do get to the main night game, I better run over a few things because it is the 14th of January and there's a few things that have happened. Uh, Brunst is on his way out. He played in the last game. He's going to go to Benfica. He's going. He's gone to Benfica to 5.5 million. Could raise to 6.25 million. Uh, no one else has come in. Bit of good news, we did have 20% of transfer revenue, now we've got 40%. I've kept on asking for it, I've asked for more wage budget, for more transfer budget. They're giving me breadcrumbs, they're giving me little bits and pieces. Um, overall balance club is 14 million. I've off accepted, accepted an offer for Mendes, if I can find him. Let's put it in positions. 3 million uh, for Lante, uh, and what else is happening? I do have uh, this guy, Wilfred. Signed him on a free transfer. He's going to come out at the end of the season. He looks very good. I, I really like the look of him. Uh, four star, four star. Still no five star, five star. Stewart rejected that because I need cover for the left back. I ain't got enough enough players. And I also transfer listed for Janovic. We're trying to get some money in for him. 
We've got a lot to do at Old Trafford. Maybe you might say too much to do and Nani needs late fitness test. So I'm going to go with uh, DiMaggio. Uh, Fuentes, but Petitjan, Sudoku and De La Rosa all injured today. All not making it. Have I even said the team? Rudd, Stewart, Paskey, Brown, Asselin, DiMaggio, Lang, Denise, Dominguez, Thomas and Anila. Uh, Asselin's going to have to play right back because we've got no Brunts, no Petitjan. And Vajanovic could play there, but Aslin, we're going to go with Aslin. Brown and Pasquet at centre back. I think that should be quite a good pairing, but we're facing Maynard. And this is what I mean. I think I've got to be realistic um, with the underdogs. We were season previewed, finished 20th. We're in the semi final of the Carabao Cup. I'm just a bit frustrated at this stage. Three seasons, the third season in the Premier League. And by this time, normally. In my other non-leagues and beyonds, we've we've done better than this. We've had the reputation, but this we're struggling. Even though it's the third year in the Premier League, we're struggling for reputation. We've only still a three-star club team, and we're struggling to attract the players. But this FM's a little bit different to the other ones. Must be uh, also struggling. I tell you what, we're struggling to do is have a chance. But like I say, got to be realistic. It's Man United. They are a good team, but. But, and this is a big but, we beat Arsenal in the Carabao Cup to get this far. And Newcastle. So I know, I know we can up, upset the odds and beat these teams. We're one nil down on the day. I know we can. Just be positive, Tony. Just be positive. Actually, I say be positive. Let's go positive as well. Because we need to create some sort of chances. We, we're not going to do anything. What's the point of losing 1-0? We might as well lose 5-0. At least have a go. Have a chance. We've got so many yellow cards as well. So I wouldn't expect... I wouldn't be surprised if someone else gets sent off. We could have kept that first one. Leonardo's turn up today. First game, he was shocking. Second game, he's on fire. Or is he? He is. Ah, oh, come back for a semi-final of the Caraba Cup where we've actually we started to pick up some form. We're playing well now. We've got a good tactic. The Wayne of Eight is doing really well. And I'm sticking with the Wayne of Eight. Good save. Um, And yeah, click record. Like I said, it's been a while though. It's been about a week since I've actually played the save. And now, now it's it's not good. It's not good. Shouldn't have saved it. Should have carried on playing it. <laughs> Should have filmed the whole season. Should have done it all in one day. Uh, here they come again. We might as well make some substitutes because this 11 is not going to get us back into this game. Asselin. I don't think maybe a right back. DiMaggio. And Annie can come on. We'll just do the two subs for the meantime. Got no Bronze to play right back. And I've tried to list with Vijanovic. Might need to actually get a replacement in before if there are any offers coming for Vijanovic before I accept any offers. Because we're very, very short on right backs. Brown's on a... is actually knackered. Fana can come on for Lang. Newell... Really, I could I'm just just I'm gonna leave it like that. Murphy, I what's wrong with Murphy? Two days ago, complete re rehabilitation. Uh, we're gonna leave it like that. If worse comes to worst, New New might have to play centre back, or Stewart might have to come along. If Brown gets so far that he can't do anything, um, it's very disappointing. I've, I really thought, I really thought maybe we might cause an upset. I thought this Carabao Cup, we've really been up for it. The players have been loving it. Uh, Newcastle, great. Arsenal, great. May United, fast leg. Maybe if we would have uh, got into that game and not got someone sent off, we might have really be able to do something. We could have kept the first leg at nil-nil. Kept the first leg at nil-nil. We might have been able to done something. Old Trafford, though, it's a hard place to go. Got the home fans. 
They get the extra Fergie time as well if they're losing. So it's a hard, hard place to go. Oh. We tried. We tried. We tried our best. Three shots. We, we did try our best. It's just our best is not good enough in this team. It's just not good enough. I don't want to keep blaming the team. I don't want to keep blaming this team. We're doing our best we can. I'll give it to them. Don't give it to them. Oh, I'm not actually that bothered. They are 3 0, 4 0, 5 0. What doesn't really matter. A loss is a loss. We're out. There's no goal difference. Doesn't really matter. We've got a minute to go. So disappointed. I'm so disappointed. And I don't know why. But in my mind, I thought we were going to do it. In my mind, I thought we were going to, we, we were going to do it. We are going to get to a final. We are going to do it this season. I, I can feel it. We are going to do it. Um, I'm going to accept these offers <laughs> for Vajanovic. Actually, I better look see if I can. I can't. That's so stupid. I should uh, see if I could have uh, adjusted it. But anyway, I feel I'm just all not with it because of that. Leonardo, first game, absolutely crap second game made up for it okay what do i need i need a right back i mean we're in january here i ain't got no once he goes 40 percent of nine million is five four four million we might get so i have five million to spend what can you get for five million in the premier league that's going to bolster this team to make it a team that's better than what everyone... We are no longer the worst team in the Premier League. I've already mentioned that before. I think I've seen this before. But I don't know if I mentioned it on camera. We're no longer the worst team in the Premier League. Burnley are. League-wise, really, that's what it's all about. 30 points. We could get still get to Europe. Eight points away from Villa. Just need to go on a little run like this. That's what we need now. FA Cup. It's going to be a tricky game against Brentford. Let's come back in March where we play Everton and Tottenham. And then we come back for the end. Last game of the season where maybe, hopefully, we are playing for Europa League. Or we'll be playing for 10th place. More likely 10th place. Thank you so much for watching. I do really appreciate it. If you can leave a like, subscribe and all that good stuff. And if you've got any advice, give me some advice. What do you reckon is wrong? The tactic, the manager, some of the players. Do you reckon I need to get a better right back, a better striker? Like I showed you, I've got a striker coming in next season. Uh, Wilfred, don't want to try and say his surname. This is the level we can get. Is this the level that's going to score load of shed load of goals in the Premier League? He's not doing too well. He's not doing too badly in Belgium. We will see. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next episode.